Hi, this is Paige here. Um, a question was posed to me the other day about why I am so passionate about composition, music composition. And um, I didn't really have a great answer, except that I love to do it. So I spent some time thinking about it, and I think I've nailed down why I'm so passionate about composing. Composing, if you, if you pictured my musical life as a wheel, composition has become the hub, and it informs every other aspect of my music. Uh, I've been playing music for over 50 years, and the last 10 to 15 years I've started composing, and I've, I've noticed a couple things. First of all, I've come to the conclusion that composing is is soloing at a snail's pace and soloing on my instrument bass or guitar is composition at breakneck speed like a rocket the same elements apply to both for instance and you learn this in the in the course um, there's a there's a rule of skipping and stepping where generally if you skip up melodically you step back and so your lines never and your lines shouldn't always be going the same direction all the time. Um, so if you skip up, you step back. If you skip down, you step up. Skip up, step down. Skip down, step up. I started applying that to my uh, improvisational playing on my guitar and bass, and it has made a big difference in my lines. In s composition, I've learned to give my melodic lines uh, a contour peaks and valleys uh, and I and that is starting to inform my soloing I'm starting to think in terms of aiming for an emotional peak and then falling back coming down to a valley going high going low uh, don't stay in one place on the neck make your instrument say something um, I've learned that uh, phrases and cadences are very important in a composed piece you want the listener's ear to be informed when you're ending a phrase or when you're ending a section or when you're ending a, so a song. So I'm, I'm learning to adapt those cadences into my soloing. So my music composition is actually informing my playing in a lot of very, very neat ways. Um, also, if, if you were to look at music theory as the parts of a car, Composition is taking that car out for a ride to make sure everything works. Music theory is good, but how do you test it? How do you check it? Well, music composition. Composition allows you to see how thoroughly you know your music theory. When I was an engineer, uh, a network communications engineer, Theories are all fine and good, but in the at the end of the day, what really counted was, did it work? Did the network you build work? You know how you think it ought to work, but do you really know enough to make it work? When the communication network is up and running and the customer's happy, then you just prove to yourself and those around you that your theory is fine. Well, music is like that. Music composition is like that. You have all this music theory you've learned as a musician. Some of us, uh, through practical on-the-job training, as it were, as a, as a playing musician, and others in schools and academic settings. But how much of that do you really know? You don't know until you compose because it brings everything together. So music composition for a musician, in my point of view, is at the hub and the core. It's where you get to try out everything you know, and you get to do it at a speed that allows you time to sit back, to think, to ponder, to consider. And then when you find something that's really neat and it works and you like it, that can inform your playing as well as, as a uh, piano player, guitar player, whatever it is you play. So why am I passionate about music theory? No, I mean, sorry. Why am I passionate about music composition? It gives me a way of taking my music theory out for a test drive.
it is a powerful way to study music that I can apply to my playing. So music composition is at the core of everything I do musically. So why is music composition important? I guess I could let you be the judge of that in your life. I know for me, it's at the center of my thinking. I'm finding that when I'm soloing and playing, I'm thinking as a composer. I'm thinking about what notes will work, what phrases will work. I'm listening to the music around me, and I'm trying to craft a bass line or a guitar line that plays within the context of the music that I'm surrounded with. It all works together. It all comes together. And music composition is the glue that holds it together. It's the hub of my musical wheel. So anyway, just a thought or two about uh, music composition. Stand by. My course will be available, I'm hoping, by October. November at the latest. More later. Mr. G out. Bye-bye.